Warning, this is a pest control video and it will show pests being controlled with air rifles. If this is likely to offend you, then please stop watching now. For the rest of you who like these type of videos, let's get on with the action. Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Pontypool Pest Control. In today's video, I'm going to be heading back to the dairy farm to help keep the numbers of the rats down and to stop them as they make their way in from the fields. Before we get into the action, let me quickly run you through some of the kit that I'm going to be using. My gun choice is the FX Impact Mark 1 in 177 calibre. The scope is the Pad 008 LRF. And my pellet choice is the Mako Slugs 10.5 greens. These work really well for this rifle and they also give me a lot extra on impact. All the shots in this video are taken standing using the Primos Trigger Sticks Gen 3. Let's take a quick look at them in action. It's always nice to get in some practice. As they say, practice hard, shoot easy. If anyone is interested in purchasing the Sheriff's Beanie or any of the targets used in this video, please feel free to contact me on Instagram or the Pontypool Pest Control Facebook group. The small kill is 25mm and the bigger one is 40 The last bit of kit that I use is the Ick Micro LH25 Thermal. I've only had this for a month or so and since I started using it, I don't think I could go hunting without it. It's the same thing as when I used to go hunting with a torch. As soon as I tried night vision, I just couldn't go back. It's really small, light and easy to use, and the battery lasts for hours. When you have a thermal in hand, nothing can hide. If they're in the edge rows, long grass, or even up a drain pipe, we'll still see them. Now I have shown you all the kit that I use while out hunting, let's head on over and start handing out some eviction notices. Yee-haw! I only just got to the farm. No matter where the sheriff goes, he always seems to get called out for a duel. Eye contact is now made, and we're locked head to head. I hope none of you guys at home doubted me. Well, come on, how could you? He never really had a gun, he was just sat there eating cow shit. I think I caught this one taking the best shit of its life, all down through the wooden pallets. Oh well, look on the bright side. At least he doesn't have to wipe his ass now and worry about the splinters. They all seem to be getting excited tonight because the sheriff's in town. Taking their time and sprucing themselves up, they must think we're off on a date. Well, we are really. A nice wheelbarrow ride around to the slurry pit. See guys, I told you it's not all in my mind. There's another one having a wash, ready for me to take her out on a date. Come on then, jump in the barrel, let's go around to the slurry pit. I'm sure there's enough shit to go round. Ronald finally decides to come out for a midnight snack. He must be eating one of them blue pills, because he ends up with a stiffener.
when you're out hunting you have to learn to be patient and never pull the trigger just because you can. Only shoot when you're confident. Don't be mean. Kill them clean. You can tell she's been having a lot of fun tonight. Look at the size of the box on that, dirty bitch. The next two shots were spotted with a thermal. It's surprising what extra we add to the bag each time that we're out, and what we actually miss when we're using the night vision on its own. Sadly it's that time again, we've come to the end of the video. I have so much in the pipeline and I'm just trying to get a time to fit it all in. I have squirrel feeders set out ready to shoot. I have some nice ideas with slow motion and our new audio sounds. It should be epic. I have the FX Impact Mark III waiting for me to pick it up and do a review. I have squirrel feeders being made that will be up for grabs and some more targets, the list just goes on and on. I would like to thank you all for your support. It really means a lot to me and I'm very grateful. If you would like to contact me, you can find me on Instagram or on the Facebook group both under Pontypool Pest Control. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing, not to miss out on any of my upcoming videos. Thank you very much for watching, keep safe, you and your families. Until next time, all the best, Pontypool Pest Control, aka The Sheriff.